Informal learning to me is learning without a curriculum. So somebody hasn't decided in advance what it is. But it's a little tricky because there is no pure informal learning. There is no pure formal learning. It's, it's sort of a continuum where things are more or less formal. Now, I often use an analogy. A formal learning is like riding on a bus. I mean, you get on the bus, the bus is going where the bus is going, no matter what your individual needs are. You know, if you're hungry, sorry, we're not stopping at a restaurant. This bus goes over here. Whereas informal learning or things that are more informal are more like riding a bike. If I'm riding a bike, I can change my direction at any point. If I'm hungry, I stop at a restaurant. Now, in fact, I live on a hill, a steep hill, and bicyclists love it. So every day there are these groups of people in tight little French shirts bicycling up the hill. And if one of them breaks down, the next person stops to help. Because that's what happens in informal situations. You help people who are in trouble. And a lot of the power of informal learning is precisely that, where I help you learn something, you help me learn something, rather than let's go listen to the teacher or the instructor. Study after study has found that informal learning is the primary way that people learn how to do their work. They don't learn it in training classes. In fact, only about 15% of what people learn in tri traditional training classes shows up on the job. Now, we learn by making mistakes, by experience, by asking the person who's sitting next to us, a whole variety of things like this. Now, if 80% of learning is informal like this, why don't we pay more attention to it? Companies traditionally spend almost all of their budget on training for materials and courses and things like this, and they forget to do the things that would reinforce informal learning, like showing people where stuff is located, or who's important, or setting up networks, or building communities of practice. I think it's a legacy of confusing learning with schooling. In schooling, we had a bunch of kids who were novices, and we wanted to fill up their heads. And frankly, we don't do that great a job of that, but that's the model which has been used again and again in corporate training, and it's, it's totally inappropriate.